Kim at Lincoln Culinary Institute, and today I'm going to be preparing my signature dish, which is chickpea loaf and arugula salad with cherry tomatoes um, with a garlic, lemon, and olive oil and basil dressing, and um, my uh, reckless potatoes roasted um, with a vegetarian um, gravy. So here we go. In order to uh, assemble this, we're using the food processor. So first off, I'm going to add the chickpeas, which are very uh, high in, in nutrition and, and fiber. I'm also adding onions, carrots, and celery, which is also uh, full of fiber and nutrients. Okay, uh, our next step is some chopped garlic. And then we add the panko chips. Some almond milk. Some Worcestershire sauce. Some soy sauce. Some olive oil. Uh, some flaxseed meal. Some tomato paste. And some liquid smoke. And some salt and pepper. Okay. So now we are going to combine the ingredients um, by pulsing, and we don't want to overmix it because we don't we want to keep it uh, chunky and and not mushy. So we're do a couple of pulses. I'm going to scrape the sides and push it down for a couple more rounds of pulsing. about right okay so now I will be putting it into the loaf pan once I get it in the loaf pan it goes into a preheated 375 degree oven for 45 to 50 minutes and when you take it out you need to let it sit for a little while to set up to form the loaf. And there we go with that. All right. So I actually have already prepared one, and I'm going to get it out of the oven. And this is what it looks like when it's done. I lined the loaf pan with parchment paper so I could lift it out easily. I'm going to set up my dish now. I'll start with a little pool of gravy. two pieces uh, are plenty and I will 
add some parsley. Um, this is my marinated arugula and cherry tomato salad. Which is a good um, side dish for this loaf. And we also have the uh, bliss potatoes that are roasted with a little olive oil, um, salt and pepper, a little cumin, and a little bit of cayenne pepper. And we'll also add a little bit of gravy to the potatoes. And this is my signature dish.